friends. It's the next day, or it's Tracy, and Maze, and Misha from Nova Scotia Living. It is rainy today. It's Thursday. It's garbage day. But it's raining. We're standing here, so when the bus comes, oh, it's coming down the hill. Let's run out there. All right, friends, this kind of had a bum start. I got up around 5 o'clock because my husband was getting up then because he had to go to work. Had my coffee, reheated coffee. Got the little kids off on the bus, garbage day, all that stuff. Just edited a short video and I'm waiting for the big kids to come down. Fed my friends outside and Violet and Boris. I want to use up this. There's still a few days before it goes bad, but there's a nice fat cap on here. I'm going to try to make pulled pork. I wouldn't generally make a tender or um, a slow pulled pork out of tenderloin, I don't think. But I'm going to leave the fat cap on it in the slow cooker. And hopefully it gets nice and tender. I'm going to put it on low because it's like, it'll be from 8.30ish till whatever time I try to shred it up. I'll try to take the fat, cooked fat cap out before I shred it. But this, I think you just add a little cider vinegar or something. I forget. All you need to do is, oh, you need to add ketchup and brown sugar and cider vinegar. A third. God, it's tiny, isn't it? A third cup of cider vinegar. One fourth cup ketchup and brown sugar. Yeah, I'm going to try to do that. I need to get one of my slow cookers and give it a wash, though. All right, I have vinegar, ketchup, and my brown sugar's messed, but it's approximately half a cup. I want the cap to be on top. I need to get some gloves. Or a glove anyways. So I can make sure I roll this around real good. Put this, I even hit it with a hammer. Dang. It'll loosen up though. I should have put the vinegar in last so I could rinse that out, but whatever. Mix it all around. Disgusting. But I think I got some burger buns. I don't know if I have any coleslaw. I never thought of that. Usually coleslaw is really good with this, but I'll see if I can find something else to go with it. And hopefully it's shreddable if I cook it on low and slow all day long. So I'm going to put this in the slow cooker. What does it say actually? Place on in the slow cooker. Combine the stuff. Yeah, cover three hours or eight hours. It must be eight hours on slow, four hours on high. Remove from slow cooker, shred, and put it back in. Return to slow cooker, stir pork as well. Yeah. Well, I have enough time to do it. It's eight thirty-one now. I'll put it on low. I'll take it out at like 2.30 when the kids get home, shred it up, and we'll go from there. All right, it's raining even harder now than it was before, so the girls are just going to wait in the porch till the bus comes and then run out when it's time. But uh, at least it's not super cold out or anything. The furnace is turning on, though. But, yeah, she be raining out. Hey, I love you children. Have a good day. Nelly's wearing one of the wood jackets to cover her hair because she straightened it. <laughs> run, children, run! Poor Violet and Boris. I didn't let them out in the porch when the bus came because they'd try to slip out the door. Mazaya's hair is wet. But there they go. Yeah. Not the day to be standing out there and my husband took the umbrella. He was going to work. Oh, Miss Eyes waving. I love you. 
There, perfect. Oh, don't be mad. Don't be mad, be glad. Glad garbage bags. Oh, the garbage truck just left. I just heard it. Exciting. I missed the, the sexy workers out there doing the stuff, but the recycle's still out there. Oh, they're turning around and going back the other way. But they're hard workers. I don't know what their wage is, but I hope they get a lot because that's a hard job. In the winter, rainy days like this, and the scorching summer, much respect to those fellas and women if they're out there too. All right, friends, it's still pouring out. It's 9.48. I'm going to get dressed. I thought I'd stay in my pajamas all day, but I just don't feel like I'll be, I don't know, productive at all. <laughs> Which I don't really have any big plans for today, but yeah, I'm going to get dressed. All right, that feels a little bit better. I put my regular, you know, tank top over thing, but I threw a sweater on too because it's chilly in here. It's like the damp feeling. My furnace just turned on too, so I'm not mad about it. Uh, yeah, it's like 10 o'clock. Today's kind of a, not a big day, kind of. We don't really do anything big, but uh, Martin and I have been together for 30 years today. 30 years. Yeah, hard to believe, 1994 to 2024. 30 years. He's known me longer than he's not known me that's for sure and yeah but he had to work today the kids are gone it's rainy I'm just gonna try to have a low-key day like I just got a load of laundry going put my jams in there with some other straggles that were around the house pulled pork for supper I had wine I'd have a glass of wine or something but <laughs> just kidding but yeah it's our anniversary and yeah 30 years we were just teenagers uh just teenagers when we met he was from a neighbor in town not from my town and yeah to think back then we were just two two little kids um we had Medea a year after pretty much a year after we started going out we were teen parents but we've been together ever since and have a nice big family with three grandbabies two fluffy bunnies and you know we have had this is our second house we've had multiple apartments years ago you know a lot of a lot of things have changed over the years that's for sure but um i can't even imagine being with anybody else ever like we're in it together forever you know what i mean um yeah anyways it's our anniversary Alright guys, I haven't checked back in a bit. I just rotated laundry. I can't fit everything that I put in my washer and my dryer at the same time. Like when I rotate it, because my washer is bigger than my dryer. So half of it's in the dryer, half of it's still in the washer. But I do have two towels to hang up. Oh, I gotta take these towels off and a sweater off. Um, yeah, and hang these up. Right, guys it's 2 37 I had a little lay down Violet and Boris laid in bed with me which was wonderful wonderful oh and so the kids should be home anytime now it's two, like I said 2 37 I turned this up to two or to high when I went upstairs around one it, like it wasn't very long I just went upstairs to lay down I know you can't really see I'll take that out after the kids get home and put it on a platter and see see how it is I think I'm just gonna stand out here and wait for the bus it has been a very uneventful day today but I did do laundry the garbage and recycle picked up and I did have a little nap and I got supper cooked I just need to finish assembling 
So that's not too bad. Oh, Morris is out there. He didn't ever run away when I opened the inside door. Isn't he handsome? Handsome. Look at that. There's one. Sometimes we get three or four. But the girls were out there earlier. Oh, uh, yeah. But now that's rain, look at the Nerf guns and stuff on the lawn. Old soccer balls. I've got to clean up the lawn one of these days when it's not raining. So I'm just going to wait here until the bus comes so I can greet them when they get off the bus. And then I'll start working with that pork roast. Or, well, it's not even a roast. Pork tenderloin in the slow cooker. Oh, I just went to bring out a chair from the kitchen because I'm tired of standing because I'm a lazy bones. And the bus came, so... Excellent. Hopefully they had a good day at school. It was hat day. Misha still has her hat on. May still has his set of fedora. Is that what it's called? No, not quite. I don't know. One of those hats. I got at Francois Boutique. How was school? I missed ya! How was skating? Uh, Did you guys walk over there? It must have been pouring. Uh, well, yeah, but not on the way back. Oh, did they have extra umbrellas? No, she just had one on the way. How was school, bud? Was it raining when you went over? No, Skating? No. Alright, here's that pork roast. I took the fat cap off. It's on the bottom. Fat cap. Fat cap. I'm going to see if this is shreddable. I don't know. And if it is, I'm putting it back in here in the juices. You can't see. It won't let me turn my flash on. But to mix it all up in the juices. Alright, that's not too bad. I'm going to put it back in the slow cooker. We do have lettuce and cucumber, so we'll have like a little green salad with it. That's alright. These guys are in here listening to Eminem, for goodness sakes. And he should cut up some onion and some cheese. Made a green salad. The girls have had their stuff. She has some salad dressing out here. French. Catalina. Zesty Italian. And ranch. The ever-loving ranch. Oh, okay. This one's Misha. She has a little bit of everything. A cold pork sandwich and a nice big health and a salad. Well, hey friends, it's Tracy from Another Day. I'm putting an ending on this short little video. I know it's only like 13 minutes, 14 minutes. It's just one of those days, but it was our anniversary. We, My husband didn't get home till late, and he drove right into town hoping to catch the Chinese food store restaurant, but it was closed, so it was disappointing for him, like he planned on doing all this stuff. But um, He stopped at McDonald's and got us something. He brought that home. He had stopped at Superstore, too, and got one of those chocolate McCain cakes, because it's my favorite. Anyways, the McDonald's was shit. It was bad. I like both of them. So we called them. They put our name on a list. We'll get re it redone for free, but not really for free because we paid for the first one, which was garbage. But he did get a McCain's cake, and we ate the whole cake. We, I mean, they're not big cakes anyways. We just cut it right down the middle. He ate one piece, like one half, and I ate the other half, and it was spectacular. Lovely. Loved it. But we had we just spent the rest of the evening together and had a good time and I didn't really film anything but um it was good. It was good. Um yeah. We've been through a lot and we've grown. We're stronger than we have ever been and yeah, it was a good day. It really was. But anyways, I want to say peace, love, and happiness today and every single day. Please like, share, and subscribe if you so choose. But if not, that's okay too. I still love you. I still want all the happiness in the world for each and every one of you out there. I certainly do. I really, really honest and truly do. Yes, I do. So, okay, guys, with that, I'm going to say have a good night or have a good morning. And I will. See you tomorrow. Bye. Boink. Boink.